Hello everyone, and welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial, I will guide you through the basic process of installing VMware tools on a Windows Server 2025 Core Virtual Machine. VMware tools are essential to improving the performance and functionality of your virtual environment and ensuring seamless integration between host and guest operating systems. So we will learn how to do this step by step. Okay, let's get started. After logging into the Server Core Virtual Machine, Right-click on the Sever Core Virtual Machine title and select Install VMware Tools. To install VMware Tools on a separate drive on the Server Core Virtual Machine. Next, from the Basic Settings Configuration page, we have option number 15, which allows you to use PowerShell or the command line. Enter number 15 and press Enter. Now I want to change the directory to the directory where VMware Tools is installed. Drive D is always assigned to VMware Tools. So navigate to the D directory by the CD command and the drive letter and press enter. Then run the dir command to list all the VMware tools components. Now run setup64.exe to start installing VMware tools. After running the setup file, the VMware tools setup window will appear on the screen. In some cases, you may not see the setup window because it is hidden behind the sconfig screen or the command prompt. Press the alt tab key together to show the VMware Tools Setup window. In the VMware Tools Setup window, click Next. Here you have to select the setup type. We have three options, and they are Typical, only installs the software features used by the VMware product. This is the default option for all VMware Tools installations. The second option we have is Complete, and it helps you to specify the options to install all the mandatory, recommended, and optional components. And the last option is Custom and it is to use this option to specify the software features you want to install and the location where you want to install them. Anyway, leave it on the default option, which is typical, and click on Next. Click Install to start installing VMware tools for Windows Server Core. After the installation of VMware tools on Server Core is complete, click Finish button, then click Yes button to restart the virtual machine to complete the installation of VMware tools. After that, log in with the administrator account. And the last thing I have in this video is how to check if VMware tools is installed on Windows Server Core. To check the installation of VMware tools, enter the command line by typing the number 15. Then run the command that appears in front of you on the screen. I will leave you the command in the description of the video. If you see the status of the VM Tools service as running, this means that VMware Tools has been successfully installed on Windows Server Core. Thus, you will ensure that your Windows Server 2025 Core VM machine is running at its best performance with VMware Tools fully integrated. If you found this tutorial useful, please like it and share it with others who may benefit from it. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications so you don't miss any new videos. Your support means a lot and helps me keep creating more content. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video.